The luck of the vaccine lottery continues for many seniors. As they learn whether they will be randomly selected to receive shots at community sites like this one in Brooklyn Center. That Brooklyn Center site is a strategic one for the Twin Cities since there's no community clinic yet in Minneapolis. On Thursday, Governor Walls and state health leaders paid a visit to the Brooklyn Center site. Delane Cleveland was there and joins us now with more. Yeah, this is the second week that the Earl Brown Heritage Center in Brooklyn Center has hosted this COVID-19 vaccine clinic. Between Thursday and Saturday, they're expecting about 24 hundred people age 65 and older to come through. Having the vaccines here in Brooklyn Center is such an important uh, uh, piece for our community as well as for the whole North Hennepin area. Uh, we are in the easy access point uh, to the broader north and so we think that this was a good choice uh, for all of our collective communities. Brooklyn Center Mayor Mike Elliott joined Governor Walls Thursday afternoon as he toured the site with other state health officials. Every senior coming through the Earl Brown Heritage Center for this vaccine clinic was one of the lucky winners of a lottery system set up by the state. More than 400,000 doses of vaccine have been administered so far in Minnesota. Of those doses, about 92,000 are seniors. But there are still people with under underlying health conditions who aren't quite 65 years of age, and those people feel like they've been left out. When asked about this population and when they might be eligible for the vaccine, state health officials asked for people's patience. We're trying to work through the, the data now to, to kind of identify which conditions are the most significant from a COVID comorbidity perspective, and working with our clinical community to, to figure out, okay, how do we kind of factor that in? Um, and, and to give the, the, the clinicians the, the flexibility to do that. And all of these questions are really good. They're the ones that keep me up at night. Um, what about the 50-year-old that I just spoke to a woman who's had a kidney removed and is on that list? How do we make sure we're hitting those those modalities that are that are really important that we get to as quickly as possible. Meanwhile, it's important to note that next week there will be no COVID-19 vaccines offered here in Brooklyn Center. They said that they're going to take a week off and then they'll reopen the following week. But the only people allowed back will be those who got their vaccination here last week. Reporting in Brooklyn Center, Delaney Cleveland, CCX News. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.